just to be clear, this isn't a race, it is a chase. You're not to pass me. Lose sight of me, and you'll lose your way. And no tailgating. An accident would spoil the trip. All right, all right. It's at the road already. As you wish. Drive safely now. First Galden and then Lestalem. What a coincidence, huh? Way too convenient to be a coincidence. I reckon he's following us around. But to what end? That question bothers me deeply, as does his origin. It's hard for me to picture that guy in the Empire. But it's even harder to imagine him as a Lucian. I'd sooner not rely on him. But he may be our only way in to the Disk of Kothis. What's His Highness's opinion of this, Arden? <sighs> Don't really have one. He's nothing more than a creepy old dude to me. <laughs> you hit the nail on the head right there. Well, that's why we came up with a plan. Gotta watch our backs the whole way. Knocked. How are the headaches? Fine for now, but they come without warning. Wouldn't want to have one behind the wheel. Stop if you need to, all right? So, any havens along the way? Oh, somebody wants to camp. Somebody else wants a proper bed. Nice firm ground's much better for your back. Can't we at least make it a caravan? I don't get why you like camping so much. Under the stars, at one with nature, what's not to like? Now in the wild, there are no rules to follow. No check. What say we call it a day here? What say we continue on to Carthus? The Archeum's not going anywhere? Neither are we under your stewardship. So we make camp with Arden. Hell no. <sighs> Might as well get the tent up. Oh, I'm afraid I've never really been one for the outdoors. I shall foot the bill, so let us stay at the caravan over yonder. Now this feels like a road trip. Yeah, go figure. Well, well, if it isn't yours truly. Uh, if you'd rather not be in photos? Oh, I don't... of the youngest oracle in history. Is it hard giving blessings? It would be selfish of me to complain of my burden when so many suffer and wait. I hope they trust I will not rest until they are most solace. The world watched on with worry and wonder as the young girl grew. I understand you have a message for us? If you know of any who are bedridden or unable to come to me, pray, send word, and I shall go to them. I follow my calling. I will not halt my steps for anything else. In time, her strength would become an inspiration to all. What is your opinion of the treaty? When war has ended, so too will suffering subside. The treaty is a momentous step towards a brighter future. Let there be no doubt. We walk the path of true peace. She's okay, wherever she's headed.
please, set your heart at rest. I shall do what I can to ease your suffering. Lady. and light deliver us from darkness blight that is all I can do for now but trust that relief will come in a matter of days it's a miracle Thank you, Lady Lunafreya. Oh, Lady Lunafreya. I left at dawn to come see you. You must be exhausted. A, a fair bit, but more grateful than anything. Let us begin at once. We should have done more, like taken her in. Damn right. She could have bunked at my place. Well, ma'am, I'm sure the missus would understand. Don't think being married will give you an excuse not to work out. That came out of nowhere. You can't just let yourself go with the eyes of the world on you. Uh, well, I don't know about that. He seems to have pulled it off so far. What does that mean? All the more reason he needs to clean up his act now. Feel sorry for Lady Luna Freya if he doesn't. <laughs> He's got you there, Noct. Everyone would be like, Oh, she could do so much better than him. What does the Oracle need the Prince for, anyway? <sighs> Imagination run wild much? <laughs>